guys it's nice to see you again welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in today uh, I am back with another day in life vlog and it's a very simple day we have few plans first of all I need to do some meal preps uh, second of all me and my mom are going to do a bike ride I possibly take dogs um, for a walk to the little park oh, and by the way uh, this is very exciting day for me because today they open up reservations for uh, Disney World in Orlando um, and I was able to score a reservation. I woke up at four o'clock and the website crashed. I was not able to uh, reserve the spot for like 45 minutes. Then I went back to bed and then I got up at seven and I was able to get a reservation. So I'm super excited because me and my mom uh, are going to have this vacation in Miami and Orlando for my birthday because uh, we're in process of uh, applying for a green card for my mom. So she's not able to leave the country while she's waiting for her green card. And yeah, so this is kind of a vacation. We did not have a out of country vacation for the past couple of years. So this is super exciting. So I'm making this meatloaf. Um, this is like a breadcrumbs with some onions, some seasoning, some milk. And this is, um, this is the turkey, ground turkey that I'm using because we prefer it over the regular beef. So I'm just mixing it up soaking the bread and then I'm going to mix in uh, some meat, shape it and put it in the oven. So this is how the meatloaf making going. It's a huge meatloaf, but I'm using it for meal prep for my husband with mashed potatoes and I'm going to freeze a few portions, you know, for a while we're going to be using this meatloaf. So I'm going to mix up some ketchup with some brown sugar and top it up. My meatloaf is uh, ready to go in the oven. I already coated it with some sauce. I have some backup sauce that I'm going to pour over in a little while. And yeah, this is going for 350 for 50 minutes in the oven. Came to the park to go for a walk with the dogs and there are bunnies. The dogs have not seen the bunnies yet. There's one right here. And I believe one somewhere over there. Maybe he already ran away. But the dogs have not seen those bunnies yet. They are going to be very excited about that. Just going to make sure. I'm going to go scare the bunny. Because if the dogs see them, they're going to get a little crazy. Come on, bunny. Go the other way. Run to the bushes. Save yourself. Good job, bunny. You're so cute, but don't stay here. Alright, I think he's safe. This is such a pretty little park. We don't have much HOA here. I mean, we actually have HOA here, but we don't have like amenities. Nothing. Nothing like pool or anything like that when we have this little picnic area better than nothing my meatloaf is in the oven right now i am going to um stay here for like 10 minutes with the doggies so they can run around and sniff around and stuff and we're gonna head back i'm going to finish up meatloaf i'm going to edit vlog we're gonna ride a bike probably sooner than later because it's very cloudy you can see it's very cloudy and when the sun comes out around noon it gets very very hot and me and my mom probably going to the to the pool nearby we're going to do a few laps just so we can you know do some kind of cardio because my gym is still closed so i need to exercise again like 10 pounds since the quarantine began so i need to get a little bit back in shape so this is the plan for the day let me guys know how you cope with the like physical activities during quarantine um because i'm curious like i cannot do many exercises at home because i'm lazy and yeah the only way i can make myself exercise is just when i get out and i actually like go someplace and I put some effort and then that's what makes me like really you know do stuff my mom was over there enjoying the view but for right now, we're just going to hang out with the doggies and head back home very soon. Hey, buddy. You tired? Uh -huh. 
we have a dental appointment for them um, in a couple of days. They're going to put them under to clean their teeth. And I'm a little worried about that because I never put them under. Well, you know, I think I did when Max got uh, neutered. Hi, buddy. You tired? Is it hot for you already? It's just nine o'clock. I'm actually ready to go to do a bike ride. I have my iPod with me and things like that. And um, just wanted to show you I'm mashing the mashed potatoes. I add some cream cheese, butter, and milk to it. I don't have a cream or half and half, so I use milk. I'm mashing some mashed potatoes. The meatloaf is uh, ready. It's a little bit more horizontal than I would like. So I remember last time the meatloaf got a little bit horizontal like that too, but I think it's because there is um, um, turkey meat, not a ground meat. So I think it's totally fine. It, it, was, it, it tasted really good last time, so I'm hoping that I was able to achieve the same flavor. And I don't really care how it looks like. Uh, the only thing is that last time when it happened, I thought it's because I used too much milk. For the um, to soak the bread but this time I really didn't I um, removed the excess milk after I soaked the you know the bread in it so I don't know I think it should be fine so I'm going to package this up and me and my mom are going to go ahead and start the bike ride the Sun is already up so it's gonna be warm but that's okay I feel like it's easier to get it done and get it over with in the morning rather than like dread the whole day because it needs to be done we need to work out anyway so this is how this uh, meal prep for Preston looks like I used to I was able to make five portions of uh, meatloaf and mashed potatoes and I also am um, going to freeze these bags of two I actually have three bags of them uh, so next time if he feels like he's running out of uh, meal preps or he is you know wants something else besides what i made he always can freeze it or like a defrost it the night before so or just defrost in the microwave and he's set for two meals we just got to the bike trail and me and my mom are gonna do a bike ride she's probably gonna go ahead and i'm gonna film and this and that but yeah we're about to start a little bit of exercising for today My meal prep for lunch it's some scrambled eggs it's supposed to be breakfast but i keep forgetting to use it for breakfast so it's gonna be my lunch it has some mushrooms tomatoes uh spinach eggs all the good stuff i'm gonna have some uh, orange some ketchup with the eggs some water and we are going to be ready to go to the pool i'll show you really quick my outfit for the pool this is uh um walmart this is target this is, I think, Target, so very fancy. <laughs> Let you guys know what you think. It's very comfy, and there's nothing like super fancy about it, to be honest with you, but I feel like it makes my mood very like vacation-like, so I like it. Okay, so now we're finished with the lunch. We are going to the pool. Today, um, kids are in school, so we'll have like a free day, but we're just chilling. So, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about my hair today. Uh, but anyway, we are on the way for the pools. You have to make reservations now. So we'll have a slot from 1 p.m. to like 2.50. We're probably going to get there 20 minutes later. So, yeah. Just going to go and hang out and see how everything works out today. If it's too crowded or not. Looks like it's packed here. 
but we're just gonna keep our distance mind our own business and we have this little like a gazebo or something in here and this time we brought the beach chairs because uh, they only have like this sitting sitting up chairs but they said that we can bring our own they just don't have enough they used to have like lounge chairs here but this ones we can actually recline and relax in those so we're in a restaurant we're like changing I sprayed myself everywhere because I keep burning everywhere because I keep forgetting to apply the sunscreen so this time I'm all shiny because I did not forget So this is guys like a real, really perfect day at the pool. The water is so warm, the sun is perfect. So I think we're gonna stay here 20 more minutes till the end of our reservation. And after that, we might start heading back home and just like maybe go to yogurt land or something like that. But yeah, it's been very nice so far. My mom's still seeing because she does not want to waste her time on a lounging around like me. But I need some time in the dry land as well. And we are in yogurt land now. They have like you self-serve frozen yogurt, but then they help you with toppings after that. I got some chocolate yogurt and some mangoes, got some fruits. I mainly get fruits and like nuts and the chocolate syrup. And this is what my mom got. She got a little bit of a different mix, but very similar. Very yummy.